Hi, I'm Andrew Carr. I'm the CEO of Epiphany Consulting LLC, as well as the founder of the HR Success Academy and Boom University. And I want to welcome you to another Aha Monday. As you can see, I am not in my studio. I am on the road. I'm in a hotel where I spend a lot of time because I travel across the country working with businesses and working with individuals on how it is that you can get more. I'm excited right now because I just got finished having a tremendous event in Kansas City and now I'm on my way to Florida here on this AHA Monday. But I could not let this AHA Monday go by without getting a chance to chat with you because this is one of the best parts of my week because it's a time where I can just sit here and we can talk about goals and how do we succeed and how do we move forward in our lives and in our businesses and do that. I have so many great business people who I work with who check these AHA Mondays out. Also people just working and doing things individually as well too. Um, like I said, what we, what we allow for people to do is to be able to figure out how is it that you can accomplish more. So first, I want to thank you so much. Just thank you for taking a time out of your day to check this vlog out, to be able to do it, to be able to do these things. Um, and so I, I commit to you by doing it, and thank you for committing to me by checking it out and listening to it and being able to do it. So I want to talk about a quick point today. And it's actually good that I'm here without without the studio or some exotic location or anything about that because it is right in the middle of the night in a hotel room. And so um, I it's good for me to talk about what we want to talk about today and that is honesty. And so when we're talking about honesty, um, are you honest with yourself about your efforts and what it is that you're getting done? In your life are you honest with yourself about what it is you're really trying to do and like the goals you're really trying to be able to get knocked out um, in our 21 day success challenge which you should check out definitely um, we talk about hey, when was the last time you stood in front of a mirror naked and just really looked at yourself and I don't mean that literally I mean that really figuratively in what your habits and what your ways are and what it is that you do and how you get things done because the results in your life are directly resulting they, they directly show from the actual habits and the things that you do and the things that you do that the energies that you put in and that you get knocked out and so when i have great results in my life I can go back and look at it and see it's because of the habits and the efforts that I was putting in. When my results are not so great, I also can go back and look and see that. But that is a point of honesty to where we have to be honest with ourselves and say, okay, this is what the real issue is. It's not just that people are lined up in a committee trying to figure out how to stop me. Because we look at that in our lives many times. We say, yeah, it's just everybody trying to stop us. It's everybody just hating. You know, like I said, we have this whole way about in life where we're constantly thinking about the haters and the haters are doing this and different things as far as that. People aren't concerned about you. They really aren't. What they're really, really concerned about is themselves is because by nature we're selfish. And so we have to be honest with ourselves about the energy and the efforts that we're putting in. So if you're unhappy about something that's going on in your life, Many times, if we're honest with ourselves, we can go back and look at our own efforts and the own things that we're putting to it. It's one of the reasons why I like running my own business, because when you run your own business, it is a meritocracy. It is about whatever it is that the energy that you put into it is what you're going to get out of it. So we've had great success at times, and that's been excellent. But when we're not as successful and we don't hit the goals that we're supposed to hit, the only person I can go back and look at is myself. And that is actually powerful because I can say, okay... There's something I can do. I have, an, I have an option. I have something I can change to be able to do that. And so I want you to think about that this Monday or whatever day you're checking this out. What is it that you can change? What is it that, be honest with yourself about your efforts and your energy and what you're doing. Don't just think that it's just someone just trying to stop you from getting whatever it is you're trying to get in your life. It's not that. And so uh, oh, uh, something I mentioned at the very start of this was the 21 day success challenge. I want you to go out, if you haven't done that, check out the 21 Day Success Challenge. It's a free 21-day program where you can do some journaling for yourself. 
and where you can really say, okay, what are some ways for me to be able to move better, to be able to do more in my life, to be able to get those things done, all right? And so I want you to take that time, take the challenge, do those things. So happy that you're here checking out my videos and those things as well, too. If you need business help, please hit me up at ojinga.ojinga.com. We also do coaching. I'm, I'm running and rolling out a new coaching program coming here very soon as well, too. I'm excited about what's going on in my life. And I'm excited about being able to help you. I think I'm moving more towards being able to help more people individually, which is a lot toward what it is that is my goal and my purpose in life. Uh, because it is my mantra that I'm to leave a, a positive residue on everyone who I meet. It is my destiny to leave a positive residue on everyone who I meet. So hopefully I'll have that residue on you here today. Have a phenomenal, phenomenal week. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.